Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a very exciting one because it's the day we get our keys to our first house which is very exciting. It's the 24th of October and it's the afternoon now. I've been waiting all morning to get the phone call to say that the keys are at the estate agents ready for us to go and pick up and they are there now. The only bad thing is, which has put a little bit of a dampener on it, is that David's on a late shift today and he's had to leave for work because we had hoped that we would have got the keys earlier on than what we have, but needs must and all that, he needs to go to work. So my mum's going to come with me to get the keys and then we're going to go to the house and have a look round because it's been like five months since we've had a look round. Um, we are going to be moving slowly, we're not going to be moving today or anything. We've still got like three weeks left in this rented house so we're just gradually going to move our stuff over. All the decor and everything at the minute is fine, it's perfectly livable. It's only been done for about six to eight months and it's had all new carpets and everything like that. So yeah, we can literally just move straight in. Um, I do need to get some measurements today to find out if certain things will go in certain places, things like that. And we need to order a new dining table and a new sofa because we're not taking ours with us so we might end up sitting on the floor for a few weeks but there's no point taking our old one with us when we're not gonna use it is that amy there Hi. Hi, uh, okay in a minute so yeah ellie's having a quick nap and then we're gonna head on over so i'm hoping to do a empty house tour today filmers like going into the house for the first time so yeah i hope you enjoy it and yeah, I can't believe we now own a house. Eee. I will do a proper house tour in a little while but we've literally just walked in this second so I'm just going to have a quick look around. So I'm just going to do a quick empty house tour before my mum gets here. So this is the front door here and then you face this when you first come in. So here's the door. So then you see this hallway. So to your left is our kitchen we will update this one day but for now it's perfectly fine the only thing is it won't fit our massive american <laughs> fridge freezer so we are hoping to remove this radiator and put a door here because that goes into the garage that's what we're hoping to do so then you step out of the kitchen into this little bit and then on your right hand side we have the downstairs toilet. To the left is our stairs. And then this door is the living room and dining room. This end is the dining room. Can you shut that door please? This end is the dining room. The carpets are all really new which is really good. And then the wallpaper is not too bad, so we'll keep that. And then this is the living room end. David wants to eventually get rid of that, but we'll see. So yeah, I'll just span over the room from this area. So this is the living room, dining room. And then we've got patio doors going outside into our garden, which is quite nice. And then it goes down the side there as well. Oh, and we've got a cupboard over here. This is for storage. Which is quite big. So 
So I'll just show you upstairs quick. So again, we're in the hallway, so upstairs. I like this area here because it's like open, you can see straight down the stairs. So this is at the top of the stairs. This little room here is Ellie's room, this is the first room you get to. This is just a single room. So if I stand over here. So this is Ellie's room. Perfect for her. And then we come out. And then you can see down the stairs. And then this is what you see at the top. So on the left here is a cupboard which is handy straight on is the girls room it's not the biggest room but they're going to have bunk beds and then over here they have got a massive cupboard that's going to be like their wardrobe and where they store all of their toys and stuff so yeah i'll just pan around for you And then from the other side, I'll show you. So their bed's going to go along here, I should imagine. So we'll go out of here. Turn left and you go into the bathroom. Now this will need updating one day, but for now it'll be fine. So we've got this floor here. Towel rail, window, sink, toilet. We've got a bath with a shower so yeah it's not the biggest bathroom but it'll be fine then the biggest room is ours the carpet is grey but it's not really picking it up on the camera the wallpaper is fine for now they've left their curtains which is handy because they're really nice I don't know if you can see they're really nice so when you look wardrobes there. back we've got built-in wardrobes there and then we've got our ensuite. So I'll just show you the ensuite. So there's the toilet, a little cabinet. So there's the shower and the sink, which is fine. So then our room is probably the biggest out of the lot. And then we've got this space here. And then you can see out the front, so we're not overlooked by any houses or anything. This is a private drive, so as you can see it's very private here. There's no main road, there's no dangers for the children or anything. So yeah. Like I say, the carpets are really new. So we won't have to worry about changing any of those. So yeah, it's a shame that David isn't here to come in for the first time, but we got the keys a little bit later than we thought, and he had to go to work. But my mum's coming in a minute, so she'll be able to see it. Okay. Do you like it then? Yeah. Ellie, do you like your new house? No, you, put this on you the like it? This is our new house. <laughs> She's like, where the hell am I? Do you like it, Soph? Yeah? yeah. Is it nice? Yeah. Nice and big. I think you can do this. Ha, ha, ha.